Mayor, wake up. T Welcome, Welcome to, to Awkward. Awkward. My name is Jesse. My name is Jasmine. And today we'll be sharing with you a couple of stories from four of our guests and their awkward moment. And first, we'll be introducing Kai with her video. Did you see that status on Facebook? I thought that I was really great at cutting my own hair uh, until about kindergarten, right before picture day. I decided to lock myself in my bathroom with a pair of scissors and just start chopping away until it got to the point where they were about this long and spiky. <laughs> um, I realized that it wasn't that great of a haircut and I tried to slick it back with water um, trying to kind of hide from my mom until she called us into the kitchen for dinner. My mom, mother of three, young, kind of impatient, just got off from work and she, I had really long pretty hair at that point and she just didn't, I mean, cut my hair a year before and the reaction wasn't all that great so I was really nervous for her to see this and I tried to hide it from her but then she realized that my hair was back so she decided to push it forward and then realized that I had no bangs and the last words that I remember coming out of her mouth were you better run kid because I am going to chase you. Do you see that? Okay. Oh, welcome oh. back. Please. Welcome Kai to the stage. Kai. Kai. Hello, um. Kai? Kai? Uh, yeah, right here. Kai. Um, Kai. Kai. Uh, no. Hi, Kai. No, dude. Come here. Um. Oh. Wig. Who is this? Who is this I don't imposter? Know, but I got ID to prove it and everything, dude. Oh, okay. Well, please come sit, Kai. Can we get security over there? Secure it. Security. security. Okay. <laughs> here we go. Well, Kai, how are you doing today? Welcome, Kai. That, so, we have a couple questions. That was really... Interesting. Awkward. These bangs. I mean, yeah. and you know, they grew out. Why'd That's the good them? thing. Yeah, well, why okay. did you cut them? Um, so, you know how <laughs> in a, like kindergarten you don't know that like if you have short bangs, like, the ones that grow out and mm -hmm. add cowlicks and everything. So, I thought that if I just chopped them off that, you know go away, but it yeah. ended up being spiky, so. That's horrible. Um, like, um, did you get made fun of? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Because you know how in kindergarten you have the same group of people that you go to, like, all the other grades until, like, fifth grade? Mm -hmm. Yeah, they remembered, and I was spike until about, like, fifth grade. Wow. Oh, um, where, where, where it was kind of like this, oh? but, like, with less hair gel. Oh, can you not so touch okay. that? <laughs> um, how, where were your parents? Uh, my mom just got off from work, and uh, so she didn't really notice until about dinner time. Oh. If you touch my hair one more time, I might back in. Hey, it's okay. It's okay. Um, <laughs> <coughs> well, Kai, those were all the questions we have for you today. Right, so. cool. <laughs> no. No. Okay. It's okay. And uh, our next guest <coughs> will be really? Jonathan with his show. Let's roll that. He's just... No, let's just stay here. Did you see what they Bro, posted on Facebook? Do you see her go? trying to get up? Can I go? <laughs> I don't, no, you stay. No, you stay, buddy. No, can no. I? we like you. We like you. We like Too much. You. Can't let you go. Hello, I'm a turkey, and this is a story about how I got flustered. So one day, I thought I could wash this extremely tall car. It wasn't mine, but it was very tall. It was around nine feet and six inches tall, and. So I had a little bit of trouble, so I thought, oh, I think that if I brought my friend Beaver along, he, she might be able to help me. So I walked over to Beaver's house and asked her, could you please help me wash this extremely tall car? And Beaver asked, how tall is the car? And I said, about nine feet and six inches. And she said, heck no, that is too tall for me and I have a soap opera to go to. Sorry, I can't help. So. She went into her house and slammed the door, then turned on the TV. So, I was flustered. So then, um, I asked all my other friends, but they were watching the soap opera also. For some reason, I don't know what's so big about it, but they just like opera. And so, 
I walked home and I was very, very frazzled and um, very flustered. So that's how I got flustered. <laughs> but eventually I got my car washed. Well, I got that car washed and it took a lot of work. It took about <laughs> a week or two. <laughs> A Facebook? No. Oh, what? You oh, we're add me hey, sh oh. oh, hey, well, uh, that was a great story, that was Jonathan. A great story. Uh, welcome, Jonathan, to the stage. Hey, do you want to sit Where? down? I can move. Hey, no. no. You can just okay. Oh, oh. Uh, so, us. Jonathan. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, the, um, did you, did the turkey ever get back to his car? Um, it's a she and yes. Um, was this around Thanksgiving? No. No, okay, good. Can I have a bite of that banana? No. No? Well, yeah, you keep quiet. Um, so what was the beaver doing at watching soap opera, like? Yeah. What kind of beaver? I don't exactly know. What, what soap opera was it? I think it was something like Rapunzel's Teen Years. I'm not quite sure. That must yes. have been really boring. I don't know. Yeah, why. I don't know why they would want to watch that. For a beaver, um, you never know. What kind of tree did he run into? He never uh. ran into a tree? Didn't he? No. All I right. see that you have a uh, hula hoop. You want to um, no. maybe before, after? A... Yeah, later. <laughs> oh, OK. I'm going to go feed this banana to the dog. Um, no, that's OK. Well, I asked oh, that's for OK. It. <laughs> <laughs> that's OK. Uh, yeah, you should do the hula hoop, though. Let's see the hula okay. hoop. OK. <laughs> Yeah. See, work form. it. Baby got back. Okay. 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 Thank you, Jonathan. Okay. Thank you, Jonathan. Um, that was great. Thank you. That was awesome. Um, so it's um, time for my story. Next. Oh, it's my story. It is time for your story. It is my story. Kai, oh, what are you God, doing? It's okay. Okay. Um, so one work. time, uh, I had this really awkward moment. I was. Oh, okay. Well. Next, uh, we have Alondra with a roll in. Alondra. Hola, mi nombre es Alondra y les voy a, uh, yeah, a contar un, uh, una historia rara que me pasó apenas hace poquito. Um, pues un día estaba yo adentro sentada viendo la tele y Mi hermano, mi hermanito, de repente entra y empieza a, se empieza a reír. Y yo le digo que qué que, que había pasado. Y va afuera, voy para afuera. Y él, um, y la silla la había quebrado. Y yo me iba a sentar en la silla y que la silla se quebra. Y me caigo para atrás. Todos los amigos de mi hermano se empezaron a reír. Y me fui para adentro. Con mi mamá y ya de ahí. Okay, oh. oh, fui otra vez para afuera y acomodé la silla. Así estaba normal. Y después mi hermano um, sale afuera y siente la silla y se quebra y se cae. Y después um, mi hermano la, la acomoda la silla y se mete para adentro. Y ya después mi hermana sale y se sentó en la silla y que se cae. <laughs> Y también la acomoda para atrás y se mete para adentro y después sale mi mamá y mi mamá se iba a sentar en la silla, pero le dije que no porque no sé, no quería saber lo que le iba a pasar. Word okay. moment I had not too long back. Uh, I had gotten off the max with a couple friends to go to a bus stop. We were each going two different ways. Uh, me and one of my friends were going down 122nd. My other friend was going down Stark, and the Stark bus had already got there. And uh, as that was happening, my, uh, we told my friend that we would wave the bus down to get it to come across the street and stop for her. But she said, no, that, that's OK. 
And uh, as we were doing that, I realized that the, the light was red, that the bus was gonna have to wait for it. So I yelled to my friend, no, you just need to run. The, the red is light. And it was actually Jasmine here. <laughs> and I got made I fun of for that. quite a bit for that. That was uh, hilarious. That was hilarious. Um, but, um, let's share Alondra. Alondra. <clears throat> Alondra. Alondra. Uh, oh, oh, hey, Alondra. Come on the side. How you doing? <coughs> so, um, Alondra. So, what brought you to the porch? porch? Uh, well, my friend called me over, and she wanted to talk. Well, uh, did you did you stay with your friend for a while after you fell, or was it? Yeah. Well, I kind of left. Um, and then mm -hmm. I came back outside. Oh. Okay. okay. Um, did anyone laugh? Yeah. My friend and my little brother. Okay. That's funny though. It had, I mean, come on now. Someone collapsing in the yeah. chair is never like, not funny. Laughed. That I would have. I'm yeah, not going to lie. I actually laughed. I chuckled a little bit when I saw <laughs> it. I'm not even going to lie. Yeah. But um, were you... Kind of. Yeah. Out of time, so... Oh, yeah. well. It's not... Okay, well next, uh, we're going to be sharing a story from uh, Miss Tizzle. Can Miss Tizzle. Tizzle come to the stage, please? Miss Tay. Hey, guys. Hey, how you doing? Oh, oh, are you okay? Oh. Oh, wow. <laughs> that awkward moment again. <laughs> oh, duh. that was okay. <laughs> it's good. Um, I forgot to call the paramedics for a second. <laughs> uh, uh. At least you're okay. Uh, I'm okay. We yes. didn't want to pay for that. Yeah. Um, so, what, how does your story go? Well, you know, one day I was walking in the gym. I was helping a kid go find a coat. And, you know, I'm just doing my thing. And next thing I know, I'm like, my butt's on the floor. Mm -hmm. And my heel had completely, like, slid from underneath me. And I fell. Oh, man. Were the heels okay? The heels were okay. Okay, because yes. I can... Okay, those, well, yeah. did yeah. anyone laugh? Did anyone laugh? Oh, yeah. Mr. Harris, you know, security, oh, okay. he laughed. He never asked if I were okay or anything. He just laughed at me. Oh. <laughs> I mean, so there funny. were kids in the gym and everything, and the kids, the kids ran up, Miss Tay, are you okay? I don't know if they laughed, but they first <laughs> asked me if I was okay. Well, that's good. So you say, uh, you said students, right? Does mm -hmm. that make you a teacher? I'm a school counselor. That's even Whoa. better. Yeah. That's awesome. Yeah. Nice. That's, yeah. Um, that's something right there. Mm -hmm. um, did you... What could you tell someone in an event that this were to take place, like you know, little tips before you fall mm. on your butt? Never to really trust the gym floor, mm -hmm. okay? Yeah. Because it appears to look like dry sometimes. I don't know. But yeah, and no one slippery. ever sees those uh, wet floor signs. No, no one ever. Does. I no never one. see no. those. And like, yeah. and they don't have one for if you just waxed. They could no. have just waxed it. No. But, uh, they should no. have flashing lights. Mm -hmm. really flashing cool. lights yeah. instead. Yeah. 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 But thank you so much. Yeah. You have a wonderful time. Okay. Nice to see, see you later. later. Uh, um, our next. No, you have to tell your story. Oh, yeah. my story. Is it a um, Oh, no, no, it is oh, Moni's. Moni's. Moni's rolling. Let's roll that one. This is my oh, rolling. It's your story. It's my Duh, what? <laughs> <laughs> it's my, let's roll my let's roll go. in. Wait, let's no, tell roll. my story. <laughs> let's tell my story. There's no roll in. Uh, well, funny story, actually. Um, I was uh, going to prom, and uh, I had been wearing my date's jacket. Mm -hmm. And uh, we got there, and when I got out of the car, uh, my mm -hmm. friend had actually closed the door a little too oh. soon. Um, and it caught my jacket and my oh. dress. So as soon as the car went away, um, you know. How did that make you feel? It was really embarrassing because everyone was still out front and then people saw my dress rip and then half my dress go this way, but it was over here. and. Man. It was just, it was all bad. That's horrible. Yeah. Um, so next we have Moni. Moni's rolling. Yes. Can't wait to see that. Can't wait on. Um, I thought I knew my teacher was professional, but I 
kind of learned that he really wasn't. So one day in class, I was sitting there bored since I was done with everything. And I got up and I asked him if he knew how to do the cat daddy. And I kind of was thinking he didn't know what the dance was since he was 50 years old. So yeah, around that age. And then he had like this look on his face like he was in shock since he's never heard of that dance. And he told me no, he didn't know what it was. So I taught him how to do it. And then this guy wouldn't stop doing it. Like it was really awkward because he just kept doing it. Like I was eating lunch and I looked up on the third floor and I'm seeing him trying to teach another teacher how to do the cat daddy. And like everywhere I went, um, I saw him doing it. And then he would just like come on to me and be like, oh Moni, look what I learned and wouldn't stop doing it, so yeah. moment is my entire life funny teachers right yeah. i mean they just ugh, teachers teachers these uh, days <laughs> right right um they just don't know when to stop but mm -hmm. uh was that embarrassing for you did he tell you everyone that you taught him the cat daddy or was that yeah pretty much mm -hmm. um where did oh. the cat daddy originate california california Always California. Mm -hmm. Always California. Um, I like your hair. Did you? Oh, that yours is I like the curls, right? Right? I mean, um, yeah, we're not in the salon. Let's go. Um, well, like, was did he tell everyone that you? Did he try and teach anybody? Did he try and teach anyone else? Yeah, he tried to teach him as a teacher. Nice, nice. Yes, um, yes, Could you give us a demonstration of the cat daddy, actually? Um. Oh, okay. <laughs> Who's this? Well, is know. this the cat? What is this? That's the cat, That's the cat daddy. Whoa, oh, okay. Hello. 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 Okay, there okay, we go. Okay, there we well, go. Well, thank you all for tuning in. Please join next week. Bye-bye. Bye now. Okay, you have to stay.